Hello friends, welcome to my channel. Today I am going to discuss about how to take a screenshot in Selenium WebDriver as part of Selenium tutorials. So let's get started. In case if you are new to my channel, please do subscribe to my channel. A screenshot in Selenium WebDriver used for bug analysis and Selenium WebDriver can automatically take a screenshot during an execution. If user need to capture the screenshot of their own, they need to use this screenshot method which notifies the web driver to take a screenshot and store it in a selenium and we, we can use this uh, uh, taking a screenshot in as part of normal execution and also bug analysis so i will show you how can we do that so let's jump into eclipse tool now so here i have a maven project here so uh, let let me create a package and a class from source test us test java and let me create a new package and a class so my package name is file screen short and my class is take screen and we need a main method public static void method required so click on that option and finish now we need a, a system set properties and browser initiation so whichever browser we use either it's a firefox chrome edge or ie we need to use the system set properties so we'll do that now system set properties dot set property and set property should be key value pair so we need to provide key and value so in the key section we need to provide web driver in case if it is a chrome we need to use chrome in case if it is a firefox we need to use gecko ie for ie and edge and edge so i'm using chrome so I need to use Chrome and we need to use in a lowercase driver and in the value section we need to provide the exe file location of the respective browser so if I am using a Chrome browser I need to provide the Chrome browser extension so here I have maintaining one folder which is a server so under that I have stored my exe file location and this is the best uh, uh, approach to use this servers so we no need to place it in our local and we need to call we can use it in a project directory and we can call from there and this is a very helpful in case if it is missing in local then it creates some issue so it's the best way to use this uh, servers and jars in our project directory so now we have used system set properties now we need to create a driver web driver instance so web driver driver equal to new chrome driver in case if it is a firefox we can use firefox driver ie for ie driver now we need to launch a application so we need to take a screenshot for that we need to launch a application for that we will use driver dot get under get we need to provide the url so here i am using the facebook url for demo purpose and now now we need to maximize the window after launching this website we will maximize the window to take a screenshot so let me do it uh, driver dot manage dot window dot maximize now now we need to use how do we take a screenshot this is a step we need to follow from here so this is a very important as part of interview point of view and also during the automation purpose file and because the screenshot is a file so we need to use file here and file from java io and after that we need to provide a reference so let me use a reference or screenshot and after that we need to typecast the we need to typecast our web driver to take screenshots so for that we need to use take screen shot and we need to use driver to type cache and after that we need to use dot get screenshot as so we need to use get screenshot as so that it will capture a file in the form of screenshot so under that we need to provide output type interface output type and that is an interface that will give us which type of file so i am using file type and semicolon so this line is very much important so file with the reference we are converting we are doing a typecast to the screenshot from the web driver instance then we are taking a get screenshot as and after that using a file type 
and file type as output type uh, output type dot file now after taking a screenshot i need to store that in a my uh, respective directory so in case if you have your own directory you can take that directory and you can provide here and if not it will store it in a default directory so let for that we need to use file utils so file util so uh, this is also one of the important because file util is given by apache.commons.io so that is the package we need to import in case if that package is not available we need to use i will provide that link how where from where you can download that dependency so here i have a dependency so this is the dependency maven dependency you need to add in your maven project so after adding this maven uh, dependency only you can see this file util so this is must required if this file util is not contain in your uh, uh, respective references then it will throw you an error so the file utils dot so after that file utils we need to copy our file so copy file from source and destination we need to provide source and destination so source is my screenshot so screenshot and to the destination so to destination we need to give this destination for that we need to provide a file location so for that what i will do i will do create a file new file then after file i need to provide a string parameter so under string parameter i will give my file location so what i will do i will create a folder in my maven project which is i will say images so i will say images folder and in the images folder i will try to store my screenshot images and i will say screenshot screenshot 1.jpg in case if you wanted to store it in a png you can provide a png file type and this will throw you an exception we need to throw exception now this two lines has been completed so we are successfully trying to capture the screenshot and store it in your respective uh, user defined directory so we are not using default directory we are using your respective directory and after that executing i will say sysout to know that we have executed successfully so i will say sysout uh, screenshot capture capture and after that i will say driver driver dot quit so let me save this program and run quickly so now it has successfully started and it has opened the browser then after facebook url maximizing the window then after it takes a screenshot and it says captured screenshot it means that our program has no defects and we have successfully executed this piece of code and to see the images here you need to refresh the project so here we have a uh, screenshot which is a screenshot one dot jpg that is the same file we have given here and we need to let me open this file using system editor so this is a screenshot that has been captured this is how we can capture the screenshots so we have another way where we can use the a shot so using an a shot we can take a particular logo screenshot as well not only a page but also a particular logo or particular image in the web page we need to take so we can use the a shot i will show that tutorial in upcoming sessions so i hope this session is very useful for you in case if you are new to my channel please do subscribe to my channel and please share your questions comments in my comment section thank you for watching